in 2007, the company had got to a stage and I felt I couldn't bring it any uh, much more forward than it was then. There were, the systems were breaking down, people started doing their own things, the communications within the company were not working well. It was stopping, the growth was stopping and I felt that I needed to do something about it. And it was really frustrating because I was working maybe 15 hours, 20 hours a day, I'd be up at all night sending emails up to people all over the bloody place trying to keep the thing going. And one morning after getting my hair cut, I, uh, I was listening to the radio and Brad Sugars was on it. And he said several things that just resonated with me. So, you know, I identified those points. We were turning over maybe 600,000 euros per annum. We weren't making any money. We were basically keeping people in jobs like myself. We all just had a job. Uh, the head was down. I wasn't planning. I wasn't seeing what was going in front of me, how to get there. Uh, the, I knew I could make it better, but I didn't know how. He reassured me when, I vis when he came to the office. Uh, he said that he could help me to spend more time with my family, to achieve my goals and to achieve the company goals. And it wasn't so much about the company's goals. He opened up the door and said, well, what about your own goals? Where do you want to be? That, I never thought of that, <laughs> to be honest with you. And I said, well, OK, I, I better think about this. I'm a fairly bright fella. I know I'm a bright guy. And I needed that kind of focus and I, brought, I believed that he could bring that focus to me. He also reassured me that he said within a very short period of time I would see improvements. So I said, right, Hope, um, I believe you and I will monitor you <laughs> in a very, very short period of time. If I don't see the results in a short period of time, that's the end of that. <laughs> I did see the, the results very quickly after that and uh, it, I, that proved it to me that it would work. I go home at five o'clock in the evening and I get up the next morning and I come into the office. I feel I'm leading it and I'm pushing it forward. I have a drive, I have a clear vision of where I want to be and I'm trying to now learn to communicate that with my, with my staff and my team of foresters out in the field. He's provided a structure and he's provided me with a challenge. Every week I get my head um, challenged, wrecked by him because he asked new types of questions that I would have avoided in the past and he holds me accountable to those on a weekly basis uh, and I, I could give examples of uh, if the bank account hasn't got enough money in, the, in, in this week as opposed to the goal we have set for, for in the week, he said well why is that? And I said well we're not collecting the money fast enough, why is that? And he goes down and down and down and eventually